prefer to have you here in person instead of over the internet or whatever to do it. But actually, you, here, 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 here. The, the first thing that grabs me when I, when I pick up a glass of Angel's Envy is, is, are the aromatics. You swirl it and you start to release a lot of those aromatics. When you bring it in a little bit more, you start to pick up some of the port notes. So that's the first thing I go for. I spend a lot of time, and people think it's almost kind of crazy doing this. It's almost like a reassuring thing to me. So after that, we'll take a drink. There's so much that's in play. You've got a lot of different flavors. You almost have to sit back and wait just a minute because it's really bombarding you with, with a lot of different complexities. You've got your typical bourbon taste notes. I'm, I'm tasting the port, which I'm seeing in the color also. You've got a little bit of pink. A little bit of pink you're seeing in the color. Um, the finish is long. It, it, that texture from the port wine gives it that nice long finish. And that's how I walk people through the tasting. Everybody has different impressions. Not everybody picks up the same thing. So um, I want to hear from my, 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 uh, the drinkers of Angels in Me. I want you to tell me what you see. I want you to tell me what you think. And I want you to tell me what you think we can do different, what we can do next.